City in Pewaukee is mourning the loss of a dearly loved coach who recently lost his battle with Alzheimer's. Jessica Maduker shares the legacy he leaves behind. He was a father and coach, but here at Pewaukee High, they'll remember him as a legend. You know, you've lost the guy who was kind of the bread and butter of the wrestling program in Pewaukee for, you know, over three decades. Mike Brown coached youth wrestling in this gym for decades. He loved working with the kids, he, his smile and his laugh and his love for, for people and kids. He was a very comforting sight. Something about him, he had this aura where it was like, oh, come on in. He welcomed joy to what one would think is an intimidating sport. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The way he... He would approach wrestling. It's different. I mean, he had this aura about him that was really joy to be there. Coach Brown created not just a program, but one that would win championships. About four years ago, he was diagnosed with Alzheimer's, but still continued to show up for his team. One of the things with frontal lobe atrophy is it takes like more emotion away. Despite the disease, he fought till the very end. He, he was still very passionate about the fundamentals and the techniques of, of wrestling. Coach Brown passed away just two weeks ago. One of his last wishes was to continue to develop and enhance the gym here inside Pewaukee High for generations to come. We started a, a GoFundMe page and in a week we've raised $17,000 already and it'll go towards continuing to upgrade the the room. And while he might be gone, his wrestlers hold on to one thing. Just a smile and how passionate he was. And a funeral for Coach Brown will be held on Saturday. His family has created a GoFundMe page to help support the wrestling program here at Pewaukee High, hoping his legacy lives on. In Pewaukee, Jessica Maduker, TMJ4 News.